Bill Wrigley has been, custo uh, been custodians of soil here on Furrowfield since forever. It's always been our job to keep the dirt in good name. And now, as the children of Argon are off my case, I can get started again. Can't wait to see the old place overflowing with life. Green from beach to bluff. I suppose I should start by turning some of this orange slime into some nice clean earth, shouldn't I? Oh yes, please, Wrigley. You've no idea how long I've waited for this. I'm so excited to see you sanitize the soil. I know, but how am I supposed to know which bits you want cleaned up? I see. You're using scarecrows to mark out where you want the fields to be. So I should work my magic on the mud around them. Uh, them moments. Sounds like a plan. I'll get started right away. No time like the present, is there? There we go. Oh my god. Oh wow! Wow, that's quite impressive, I've got to be honest. Well, that pretty much did everything. Uh, Alright, so let's use my blade. I can harvest this now, yes, I can. And it does seem like they're immediately being replanted. I'm not getting any extra seeds, but they are being replanted. That's perfect. Uh oh. What? Monsters are marching towards our crops. <gasps> you little wretches, you. Be gone! Get away from my food! Brittany! Mala! <laughs> Damn it, they're faster than I am. Nope. Little wretch! My goodness. There's more fighting over there. Okay, so have I got to build like defenses and stuff? Because that's amazing. Head back here, you! I'm scared! Well, you should be! I'm trying to steal my stuffs! It was interesting who came out here to fight, though. Whereas a load of other people rushed inside. Okay, right, uh, let's see. Yo, Abak, now that Wrigley's on board, this one's about to seriously go off. The only thing is, the monsters are getting thirsty for our fresh fruit and veg. And as the only soldier in the Furrowfieldian Guard right now, that's kind of a problem. Obviously, we can't just stop growing food, like, duh. I figure what we need is better weapons, and that's where you come in. Any ideas? If not, then practice makes perfect, I guess. Maybe if you and Marloth go out and rough up a bunch of monsters, it'll give you the inspiration you need. A stone sword will be pretty lit. Make me one of those and give it to me. Of course, a sword isn't much use without a swole soldier to swing. <laughs> nice, thanks so much. Oh, that's good. It does recognise I've already done that. The sword is well sick. Anytime you invent a new weapon, you should whack some uh, up and give them to everyone who can swing them. Then everyone who's like, oh no, the monsters are too tough, will be like, oh yeah, tough luck, monsters. <laughs> Back in the day, I would have been hyped for all the things I could smash with this sword, but I don't really believe in the ch children and their master of destruction anymore. Master of destruction? Who's that supposed to be? Does he have a name? How am I supposed to know? Oh dear. Uh, Heike? I bet the only person who knows his name is Almighty Hargon himself. Pfft. Listen to me, Almighty Hargon. I'm so done with him. Let's start the children of Avak. <laughs> oh god. Chad was right! I have accidentally culted! Oh no! I've accidentally the cult. Oh, a brilliant band of bu building buds. Speaking of Hargon, what do you reckon he's like doing? You don't think he's going to come and smite us, do you? I mean, I certainly hope not. Well, I've got some seeds, so let's pop these down. Bonk. Got some more seeds. Let's get these down as well. Now, the thing is, does the scarecrow only ever expand out that much? I wonder. Interesting, if so.
What I would want then is to get so it's one, two, three, four in each joint. One, two, three, four. So this would be the tile that I would need to pop that on. And then everything else can be uh, built out from that. I mean, it doesn't really matter if I use actual soil or, or slimy soil at this point. Um, not so much always come from the same direction. Oh, okay, cool. You can use fences to delineate where you want to expand to. Oh, okay. I guess. So, if I built out a large enough field, right. Now, do the fences have to be too tall, is the question there, though. Hmm. Uh, yeah, this is out on the, on the switch as well. I was I was honestly on the fence on which one to get. There you go, Avak. The stinky sludge is all gone. Nothing but fine fertile earth for your fields from now on. Hey! I can't believe it. Look at all the healthy earth. Thank you, Wiggly. I'm so happy. I've never seen so much lovely soft soil in all my life. Ever since the spoiled spores appeared, I thought our island was doomed. Even when we found clean soil, anything we planted in it just withered and died. <sighs> What's wrong with you lot? Crying over a bit of dirt? We spent so long scrapping together a few small patches of arable earth, and now we've got more than we know what to do with. I'm as happy right now as I've ever been. <laughs> I'm happy too. Happy to help, that is. I'd be more than happy to clean up the soil Anywhere Avak plonks down one of them scarecrows. What do I work, Avak? It just so happens I have a few seeds squirreled away just for such an auspicious occasion, and now we have a place to plant them. Okay. Avak obtains some more cabbage seeds. And a stupid amount of wheat seeds, my lord. Okay. Uh, I want this soil there. All of it, please. I would like very much to lay down a nice big old field, I think. Let's set this up properly. Like. Now, how do the fences work with this? Uh... Hmm. I should make my his new axe, yeah. Oh, I'll just play around and see if I can get fences to work in some good way. There we go. Yoink. Let's get one of these. Come on off. Where are you? Moloth no, no. We're getting towards the next level of our field. Ah, there you go. hold still. Damn it, Malaf! Malaf! Take the gifts I got for you! There you go. What's this? Did you make me a new weapon? Haha! <laughs> Thanks, I love it! Please don't try to kill me with it. I'll use this one from now on, but I'll keep hold of the oaken club you made me too. After all, it's the first thing you ever made me. I suppose it's got sentimental power. Oh. Hola. I didn't realize you cared. Oh, this changes everything. But if you invent any weapons that would make me deal even more damage, build them straight away and hand them over. Okay. Suppose that is a thing we can do. Uh... Okay, build a shape and size the fences one high, and then plonk down a scarecrow, and it should work. Now, I wonder... Does it have to be fences? I wonder. Let's uh, let's see what we can do. What I would like is if 
It didn't need to be fences. Damn it. Stop doing that. I even make fences, I wonder. Not sure if I can. If I can't, well, that's fine. We've got other ways of getting it done. Oh dear. Oh, good. They're, they're actually going to guard this whole place. That's fantastic. And with their weapons, they may actually be able to do damage to the bloody thing. Let's grab this. I really do love the building in this stuff. It's <laughs> genuinely really, really um uh, it feels rewarding. It honestly feels really rewarding. Ah yeah 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 yeah. No thanks. You guys just get it for me. Please be with the killer rising of the ghosty. This out a bit further. Um, is that big enough, do you think? Yeah, I think it probably is. Oh, Wiggly sleeps in there. That's quite cute. Super cute, actually. You're doing a really good job. Charge up my sword. Got it. 105 EXP? Oh my lord. That's good. But I think I probably should tuck it down just so that my uh, the rest of the peeps don't get bust up. See, I thought old man uh, Bonanzo could wield weapons. The reason why I suspected that is because... Unlike a lot of the other characters, he went out to join the defense of the colony when the monsters came, so sure, I'll make him a a sword. But I tried to give him one. I tried to actually interact with him. It didn't seem like it worked. Oh no, there we are. There we go. Enjoy. That's actually remarkably good. Uh, right, I need to go and have a look, see if I've got any more... Okay. Well. I'm gonna need a few things then. Okay, what is that? Okay. It's not a very well organized field. I know, I know. It'll. I'll hopefully be able to get it to be a bit better later though. Let's just go and grab what we Oh, that's right. There's over here. Right, I'll grab all of these. Race not, what not. Uh, I've got one. You need five farms in total in this chapter, so maybe make them into a multi tiered building. Any villager that does not cower at monsters should be able to have a weapon. Thank you. Um, I am playing this blind. Um, it's not the sort of game that I'm going to worry too much about spoilers on, but uh, I. I do appreciate um, just having a, a bit of time to uh, investigate things myself, generally. Um, at least before, like for example, I, I, uh, if I uh, actively seem lost about something, then it's uh, generally fine to, uh, to let me know. But uh, as a general rule, I enjoy having an opportunity to get something wrong. Hello, Cariat. Oh, Lady Sheila has brought a... Mm. Wiggly, wiggly tally. Wiggly tally in here. Oh, come on, He's currently grooming my arm. He was trying to throw her little box of chocolate. What's wrong? You want hugs? Oh, okay. Okay, you get lots of hugs now. Wiggly hug. Mm. Oh, thank you for the kisses. Thank you for the kisses. Yes. 
Oh, I love that thing. Thank you. Oh, sweetie. Lady Sheila, the MVP! I need to set up my uh, laptop to probably have the camera all in the right place and all that for moments like that where I can just switch to the camera. But it's usually a, uh, I set it up before I start streaming. Or not at all kind of thing at the moment. But I will try to get it so that we can have more, uh, more random ferret shenanigans. All of these. Make the field bigger. I guess this is... Oh, fair enough. Make the field bigger. Hey, yippee! We did it, Avak! We did it! 50 blocks of soft, unsullied soil. Turned and tilled and ploughed to perfection. Now we have enough space for all five types of vegetables that they used to grow in the Furrowfield farm before the tea tree withered and died. They used to grow all sorts of different crops here and hold a festival when they brought in the harvest. Goodness, Avak, look, the deer tree! Ah, uh, sure, I can ring the bell. The deer tree's grown a little bigger, and it feels a lot more powerful, too. Doing these tasks is really doing the trick, isn't it, Avak? Hmm, standing before something so precious, I can barely contain the urge to destroy it utterly. Poor oh, the bastard's acting all funny again. Is he really going to blow it up this time? Now hang on. When you first saw the tree, you said you'd had a change of heart. What was that all about? Silence! I will not stand by and listen to your idle chatter when you have so much more still to do. Stop wasting time and get back to work. I'm going to need that cup of tea, <laughs> My throat is starting to hurt from doing the voices for him. Uh, apparently I'm full on hearts, though. Bong. Yeah. Yes, I'm f uh, yes, fam? <laughs> yes, fam. Oh, right, everyone, everyone comes over. Okay. Oopsie. Didn't mean false alarm. Sorry. Uh, let's see if we've got enough to finish. This whole farm. We do! Donk. Now then, can I hoist this up and then place it back down? Oops. Now. Field. Hmm. Doesn't seem to actually respond to the fact that I've got. Uh... Yeah, no, it's just it's farm, yeah. Um. The one tile wall on the watering hole. Oh, can it not be artificial? Hmm. Okay. Can I make those blocks? I can't. Right. Okay. Fine. 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 I think I can work with it. So, pop that down, and I'll grab these blocks out. Uh, oh! I think all sides need fences. It needs a fence gate, probably. Uh, okay, well if I haven't got a gate, then I haven't got a gate. There's no point in worrying about it for now. I guess what I could do instead is... Well, honestly, I'll just let them half a second. Fucking delish! I do. Right. We've got so much more clean soil now, Avak. The field even smells better. Rich and earthy. Not at all rotten like before. I thought between you, the builder, and me, the finest farmer on Furrowfield, we had the perfect duo, but now with Wrigley in the mix, we've got the perfect trio. <laughs> now we can make as many fields as we want, but that won't help us if we don't have the seeds to plant in them. Yep. 
Ridley told me about the ruins of an old farm somewhere to the northwest, on the other side of the mountain. It sounds like just the place to find some more, uh, some more seeds, right? I'll mark it on your map for you to. Uh, so go and see what you can find. New destination has been added to your map. Okay. I'm starting to want to. I feel bad about the. Oh, thank you so much. Uh, I feel really bad about this little area, though. I want to make it better. Uh, also, I need to. Blah, 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 blah. Also, blah, 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 blah. Blah, blah, blah. Very good. Uh, right. Let's see. I want to make a little area. I would love some fencing up there. Maybe. We'll see. I want some sort of like uh, little upper windows, I guess you could say. Uh, let's see, we had handrails, so I might be able to use those. Um, take out all of them, please. And then take these back out again. I mean, it does, it, I know it's not the best kind of window, but when all I've got is wooden fences to use. Having any kind of window is probably, you know, fairly big achievement. There we go. A little, uh, little windows there. And... I wish we had different types of wood. Oh, can't place it on... Oh, that's a shame. Oh well, I'll at least make it somewhat more... Um, protect them at the very least. Make it so it can't easily just jump in there from the outside. Have to go through the game. Best I can do for now, then, I suppose. Oh well. Uh, let's store those and store. Well, no, we're not going to store these. I'm going to go make myself a. Uh, a bonfire, as was suggested. Wait, good luck finding a needle in this uh, heap of hay. Oh, what does it do? <gasps> oh, North Star Sheilab, thank you so much for grabbing me a cup of tea before you went to bed. That was really kind of you. Uh, I think I'm going to make it. Oh, hello, Timmy. Why are these monsters coming to munch on my crops all the time? Tilly has decided to join me. Victory or nothing! Run for my crops, you scoundrels! Oh, Lord. Looks like they're fairly uh, competent over there. The monsters have been defeated. Glorious. So, if I plonk this down, what's it going to do? I have no idea what it's going to do. I genuinely don't. Oh, well. Pop that there. That'll do. No Scooby what this helps with. Should do though. Should go and see what if I can cook grain. <gasps> I can. Thank you so much, uh, Sauce Cowboy. Thank you very much for the prime sub there. Here, Splat. Totally. Missed splat. <laughs> oh man, I'm such a dip. I think we probably are auto host though looking at the numbers. <sighs> Alright, so got some bread. That I'm pretty fond of. Ah, that makes his first bread. Uh, 
grab the parts. We're actually getting really close now to being able to level this place up again. Okay, I think I'm ready to uh, head on out. So, the direction we need to be going in is this one. Now, Chad has been saying that uh, basically once... Um, once the, the enemies attack from a certain direction, they will always attack from that direction. That's quite, quite cool. So we know where we want to build any defenses, and probably something worth me doing, honestly. Actually setting up a genuine... Defensive area. Let's build this up. Come on, 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 and run leash. <laughs> oh, that felt good. Super good. No pun on these guys because I can take them out with two hits, but uh, with those bats, because they swarm immediately, it is actually quite useful. Down. Some more fields around here as well. I think I'll grab the uh, fences while I'm here, since I will need them. I'm really enjoying this. Uh, uh, one thing I, I've compared it to uh, up to now was the uh, game Portal Knights. But honestly, I don't feel that Portal Knights had the, the same sort of um, fun going on it. Oh, what are these then? Diagonal fencing. Oh, wow. Okay, yeah, cool. But, uh, Portal Knights, uh, it did have different reasons to go to the different areas, but they just didn't really feel that compelling. It was, it was just basically a different area with different resources, but this was got stories in the areas, and it's teaching new mechanics. A little squeak over this hill. Hi there, human. Are you looking for your friend? He's just over the other side of, the, of this hill. But he seems to have gone a little crazy. Last I checked, he was swinging his hoe around like a madman. If he's not your friend, you might want to steer clear. You can always just go and have a look, but don't mind me if he clocks you on the noggin with a piece of farming gear. I ask to say. Okay, yeah. Old, old farm. Uh, I just like trying to get down there. Uh, there are ways, though. It does appear. I wonder if I could just dig my way down, but uh, it looks like there's plenty of, of roots. We can use the vines as well as a way to go down. There we go. Gather some wood while I'm here. Like, I've seen people make the, uh, oh, Tilly's just come in and she's curled up on my couch. Uh, I'm going to need to, I'm, I really need to set up some extra cameras so I can show the pet because she's just, yeah, I, I think when she loved us to bed, if she's not ready to, to sleep, she just wants company in the house. So <laughs> she comes down here and just kills up my couch just so that she can hear me talking or, or, or you know, see me working on things. It's really sweet. All right. Hello. <sighs> What's this fiendish farmyard still doing here? Don't worry, I'll have the whole blasted thing torn apart in no time. Uh huh. I don't, I don't know who you are, but if, if you're not going to help, then I'd rather you leave me alone and let me destroy this place in peace. I, I beg your pardon? You hear there was an old farm around here and you were hoping you could find some seed? Well, I expect this is the farm you're looking for. Don't worry, I'll soon have it completely obliterated. As for the seeds, um, I have some, but I won't give them to you. There's no nobler goal in life than wrecking ruin, you know? I'm sure the Master of Destruction himself is watching me right now as I smash this place to smithereens. Mm. All I can say is, it's a small mercy this place doesn't have one of those accursed scarecrows. Those infernal poppets have some kind of dark power over me. There's one glance at one and I can't resist tilling the soil around it. Confound my farmer's blood. Whatever you do, stranger, don't use that wooden workbench to build a scarecrow and then place it in the middle of this field. Don't even think about it. Well, then, I guess... Um... Yeah. 
There you go. Also, I really want this gate. Oh, no! Did you really put a scarecrow in the middle of the field? Right after I specifically told you not to! What? What is happening to me? <laughs> well, there we go. Um, so. Yeah. I think it may be a little bit broken. Ah, ah, it's just as I feared. One glass of the skicker and I can stop myself from telling the earth around it. Oh, Master of Destruction, hear my prayer. I have sullied my hands with the stain of creation. I beg your forgiveness! It is only by your destructive grace that the field was not enclosed by wooden fencing. we so fenced in, I fear that I... I... You didn't happen to spot the pieces of wooden fencing stuck in the ground behind this field, did you? Whatever you do... Don't go and fetch out wooden fencing over here and fill in the gaps in the fence around this field. Do you hear me? No fences. Hello there, human. I'm as hungry as a church mouse. Seriously, I'm starving. All I have are these wheat seeds. But I get really bloated when I eat wheat. I think I have an intolerance. Do you think you could help me out? If you give me ten cabbages, that would keep me fed for a while. You can have these wheat seeds in return. Ah, uh, sure. Hey, human, those look like nice, juicy cabbages. You've got ten of them, too. Well, hand them over. Come on, I'm starving. Thank you so much. You've saved my life, human. I might be a rat, but I'm true to my word. Yeah, these seeds, I promised you. Thank you. That's wonderful. I knew you'd come through for me. After all, us rats and you humans used to be on the same side. What? You don't know anything about it? Well, we... Actually, now that you mention it, I don't remember much about it, either. Okay, fair enough. Well, either way, thank you. Don't mind me. Just really ruining some mistake. Yep. Hello. Hi there, human. A high-minded, high-brow, high-class boy like you shall have no problem at all with height, right? Then, I know a couple of tricks that are perfect for someone like you. Skills for swiftly scurrying to the loftiest spots. Any adventurer with his cheese knows how to climb. After all, you never know what you might find at the top of a mysterious hill. If you have a wall handy, you can put blocks against it to make a staircase. If not, you can build a tower by jumping straight up and putting a block underneath your feet before you land. Master of these techniques is the key to quick climbing. Give it a shot right now. There's a treasure chest above, up above me. It's yours for the taking, if you can reach it. Um, yeah, okay. Oh, I see. I see where you're telling me to put things. Uh, oops, that's not quite what I wanted to do, but sure. Uh, let's pop these, put away. Four, seven. Away. Uh, all two. Uh, tidy up, please. Okay. And dock. Dock. What? A seed of life? That sounds rather important. Like, strangely important. Yep. I like that block. Oh, damn it. I want that block. It looks yep. swanky. Looks better than the other blocks I've got. Ah, damn it. It's clearly a hardwood block, I'm going to guess. That would be my uh, where my money was, if that was some sort of hardwood block. Yep. I'm not going to go too out of my way to collect it, though. Very well done, human. Who would have imagined a seed of life would be hidden away in these old ruined rafters? Did you have much trouble getting up there? If you're still finding it tricky, just keep practicing. You'll master it eventually. You look like something of an adventurer to me, human. Hopefully these climbing skills will aid you on your travels. That seed of life should be quite helpful, too. It's the odd effect of making you just a little bit tougher if you eat it. You'll find incredible items like that in all sorts of unexpected places, so don't be afraid to go exploring. You never know what you might stumble upon. They say the rarest and most valuable items are always hidden in the hardest to reach places, so keep an eye out on your travels. Fair enough. Right, okay. So, again, ruining your day. Really sorry. 
super sorry. Much sorryness. And on that punk. Wooden gate, no frills fencing, that swings on hinges, can be opened, and indeed closed. I can now make wooden fencing, sell a drink of wooden stakes for constructing steady stockades. Ah, so yeah, it is the gate then, I guess, because that wall is, is okay. You, you put a fence around this field, didn't you? Why would you do that? No, it's happening again. Why? Also, I can't get around you. Oh, thank you. Man, that must suck. Being compelled to do hard manual work like that. I couldn't help myself. I plowed every inch of earth inside that accursed fence. You sly devil, I expected you've worked out how to build wooden fencing and wooden gates yourself, too. With gates and fencing, you can make fields of almost any shape or size. They're dangerous weapons, indeed. Oh, master of destruction, hear my prayer once again. I have sopped my brow with the sweat of constructive labor. I beg your forgiveness. What's that? If I want to till some more fields, why don't I go help you out in the farm? What are you trying to imply? I'll have you know I'm a devoted disciple of the children of Hargon. <laughs> this guy's hilarious. Let's take him back to the farm and turn him into a builder. Yeah. Hello, Tilly. Alright, weirdo. If you've got any seats, hand them over. And no funny business. We can do this the easy way or the fun way. <laughs> What's wrong, Caddy? Do you want to go out with him? Oh, okay. Tilly wants, wants, some, uh, wants some attention. I will be right back.